Dun, 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 dun. Just sing, just sing your way through this. Lobster ravioli with a creamy vodka sauce. I mean, come on. I'm salivating right now, we gotta get started, okay? I got about two and a half cups of flour right here. Make a little well in the middle of our flour. And then I got just two eggs and one egg yolk. Dump that in the middle. Mix around your eggs and your flour. Gonna drizzle a little olive oil on top. A little messy, but as you can see, I got a beautiful little pasta dough ball right here. Little saran wrap over the top, place this in the fridge for about 10 minutes. While a little dough ball is in the fridge, I got four lobster tails here. We're just gonna pop these into a little bubble bath for about five minutes. Once they start to curl like that, and you achieve this beautiful color right there, pop those babies off. Okay, your little lobsters are done. Get out our chopper board here. I am just going to get these out how I see fit, okay? So, okay, you got your lobster meat out of their shells. Now you're just gonna chop this. Now definitely be careful not to overcook your lobster because obviously these are gonna cook a little longer inside your raviolis. Okay, so there you have it. Throw that in the bowl. And then just kind of go by feel here. You want, you don't want the ricotta cheese to overpower you want to still be able to taste your lobster. So I'm just gonna put in a couple tablespoons of that. We'll do a little bit of parmesan. Do a little bit of lemon zest. Just a little garlic. Do a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper, and then just a bit of parsley. And lastly, let's just do a little dash of olive oil. Now look at all those lovely ingredients and then just mix this up. Okay, so you want all your ingredients to stick together, so we'll just do a couple more tablespoons of ricotta. That's the kind of consistency you want. Now just put this in the fridge, pop your little. So you're gonna start on one, and work your way up. If you get something like this, you're headed in the right direction. Da, 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 da. Oh, buddy, look at this beautiful pasta. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Grab your lobster filling. Take one of these fancy little doohicker scoopers and just start going down your line here. You don't get too crazy. Just start with that. Now what we're gonna do is just take a little olive oil with your finger. Actually better yet, you can probably go like this. Let's go to the top with this guy. Okay, now take your handy dandy little pasta tool here. Look at that little guy. Not bad, huh? Okay, beautiful little lobster ravs right here. Now, I'm just gonna put these in the freezer for like five minutes, kind of firm them up a little bit more, make sure everything's all sealed. And while that's happening, we're gonna go make our sauce. Your olive oil, it's been heating up. You're gonna throw in your onions. And while you're making the sauce, you can start heating up some fresh water for your raviolis. Chili flakes, a little oregano, salt, pepper. Now go in with a couple tablespoons of minced garlic, then go in with some tomato paste, a tablespoon and a half or so. Some whole San Marzano tomatoes, about one third cup of vodka. Now it's a little bit of parsley. Okay, our sauce has been simmering for about 10 to 15 minutes. We're just gonna go in with a little bit more salt. Now I'm gonna go in with a little cream. This is about a half a cup of cream. Let's go in with a little Parmesan. Just let that simmer for another five minutes and you're good to go. Now while your sauce is simmering for the last five minutes, you're gonna pop in your raviolis. So your little scrumptious raviolis are just gonna go for about four to five minutes. We are now gonna pop those off the heat. I'm gonna go in here with our raviolis. A little bit of our sauce. Add a bit of parsley in there too. That's what you want right there. Beautiful. 
go in with our beautiful little raviolis. There you have it. We're gonna add some of our sauce now. Do a little parsley over the top. Parmesan. Look at that, come on. Let's dive right in. Grab your favorite glass of vino. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Look how easy that was. Lobster ravioli right in your home. Do this with the family, get messy, make some memories. Like, subscribe, press that notification button. Let me know in the comments what you wanna see next for a pasta dish. We'll see you next time.